Hello there guys, we're back with another episode of Dungeon Stars. <coughs> a few things I want to point out before I begin. You may hear me cough a lot, because I'm not sure why this room I'm in, maybe I'm thinking it's the curtains, is <coughs> making me cough a lot. I'm not sure why, but I plan to replace them soon. Uh, secondly, uh, because I wanted to get my audio ready, I did a dungeon, ended up getting a star dungeon, and that was secret pet rescue, and ended up getting a healer pet. <coughs> Bellatrix. And, if you heard just now, I've got my windows open right now. And probably will do for a while because it is too damn hot to keep them closed. <coughs> anyway, sorry for the coughs. But uh, let's continue where we left off, shall we? <laughs> In uh, second chapter, Green Goblin Menace. Goblins from the toxic bogs and swamps are notorious for using poison magics. Fortunately for us, they burn real easy and r fear fire. I thought it was an R. So, need red mostly, but I haven't leveled him up at all, so there's no point. But because of the boss here, I'll need everybody. Let's begin, shall we? Oh, I did not block that incoming attack. Also, if you do want to, if you want to ask me anything, you can do so in the co comments down below. If you want to know what kind of builds there are, what items you'll need for the, what, what my best builds are. Or if you need help with gameplay. Or if you just want a tip on a game mechanic or a certain enemy you're welcome to in the comments down below I do know a lot about this game so if you do want to know something just let me know and I'll be sure to answer it hmm I have to use a heal potion for the bosses coming up. Let's see if I can get the regeneration. This guy before I went to use a potion. Spike there. Should have saved that for that guy. Sometimes it's hard to tell which is the small one, which is the big one. I kind of forget because the sizes isn't all that different.
seeing as I will need to, as I'm <coughs> not quite in the way of getting the Rage uh, <coughs> gear as much, I'm going to have to go with the regeneration builds before I can, you know, until I get all the Rage items I need. And then, of course, I don't have much on the... Regeneration types. We'll equip that with uh, sure. Still need something to generate HP, so that's good. I think I'll stick with the shield on him. Not really anything great in the shop. Alright, on to the next mission. Oh, not next mission. <laughs> next floor. Oh my god, whenever I go into a big open room like this and then I don't see any enemies for a second, it terrifies me to think that the giant worm would appear. Because he is so annoying to deal with. It always scares me whenever I don't see any enemies for a while. Oh, what the visual glitch? I can only assume. I've seen that happen quite a few times, but I can never guess what it was. I've never seen it happen that much, though. Farming, waiting for the big guy to come out. No items. Okay. Before that ogre gets here, didn't want me to use that ability. had him with that guy. I wasn't paying attention to the health bar because 
keep on forgetting to turn off the watermark. Be sure to do that for the next episode though. Will I need blue? Not likely. And look, there's a star dungeon on the other side. Oof, I didn't block that second attack. Hey, leveled up. Full health. Ah. Anything that takes them in one shot. like that regeneration pet. Be real nice about now. Yeah, go the wet there. Yeah. Oh they are away, more damage that'll do. My generation went off so much during that. Oh, that regeneration is so nice. Oh, I did not block that. That's a visual bug. Hoping secret pet. <laughs> secret hero. All right. Time to get us another hero. Okay. For that. Anything good in the shop? Not really. Rooms aren't that long, that's also good. Oh, thought I could kill him before he got that off. Like he was just at the max distance to do all that damage.
another bit of farming. Jesus, is he stuck? He was really determined to let me know he was there. Generation off. I'd rather not have to use a hill breaking if I don't have to. There we go. I should have this. <laughs> Unless a surprise worm comes out of nowhere. Oh, I did not see that swing. I didn't see him doing a super swing. Oh, it sucks when they do it like one second after each other. You, you can barely get any hits in. I should have enough health for everybody. Oh, that was, that came, that uh, disappeared unexpectedly. Who is our new teammate? Uh, <coughs> someone I barely used on my first playthrough. Oh, nice. These are rare, so I buy them whenever I can. An assassin. This is like... This ability is basically this ability, where it strikes them repeatedly in a short distance. This one, yeah, launches horizontal projectile that freezes the enemy. This is basically like the boulder, where it runs along the ground, only this thing runs pretty much like midway through the air and I'm not I can't remember I I'm not sure but I think it's a hundred percent it freezes them hundred percentedly um actually Actually, I think I did change over to this guy because I did prefer the abilities more because 
having that one in, uh, instead of this one just just seemed much better. So yeah, uh, <coughs> let's just put junk on you for now. Might you to get that ability? And play with you with the good items. Um, sure. Actually, uh. Yeah, and some regeneration. Two pieces of regeneration. Mm. I wish I'll keep it as that. All right. Well, I think now that we've done that. Uh, that's it for today's episode. I'm trying to keep these episodes a bit shorter because I know how people say they'd prefer shorter episodes than long movies because they just don't have the time of day. But if you do want to, want me to keep them long, just say so in the comments and I'll see how you want them. The next one will be the boss hand and then after that we'll be getting another pet. So, I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. See ya!